Angela Merkel is the most astonishing and successful political survivor in Germany since reunification. Angela Merkel always wants the people around her, those who work with her, to be very, very loyal and not to talk to the media by their own. Whoever breaks this unwritten law will be thrown out immediately. She had to take the decision to throw him out because she is more, she wanted to show her authority towards him. When Angela Merkel started in 1990, the cabinet of Helmut Kohl, she was a very, very good observer. She listened carefully and she learned a lot even in or just in observing how Helmut Kohl is doing politics. When she dared to write the uh, important letter, an open letter, published in a big German newspaper, where she said goodbye to the old horse, like she wrote, uh, Helmut Kohl. Yeah, that was a big strategy and uh, it came out to be, to be true and to help her to achieve the presidency of the party. She knew or she had the feeling that uh, the demands of society do not really correspond anymore to the program of the CDU. And uh, so she modernized her party in an extraordinary way. She adapted the program of her party to the needs of society and a little less to the needs of her party. She keeps calm and carries on, which means she's not intimidated by anything. Angela Merkel, everybody knows it, is afraid of dogs and she, well, she was like freezing but she didn't show her fear and this is typical for her. She faces any situation without showing her emotions uh, or very, very few emotions. German people do have a lot of confidence in Angela Merkel and one point why they do have this confidence is because Angela Merkel is leading a very, very modest private life. So she's regarded as being incorruptible. Mm -hmm.